Hello everybody, Eagle Firefly Gaming here, I hope you're all doing well. Now this was amazing, I really enjoyed this. Now this is a personal goal for me also, uh, so I hope you enjoy the video. I shall see you in a mo. Okay, so uh, as the title says, uh, so I have tried out a new uh, system uh, and I'm trying it, trying it out in Potchevin. There's no point doing it in Nullsec uh, because, well, yeah, we all know that's going to go. How beautiful is that? So uh, one thing, uh, we'll get this uh, out of the way straight away. Uh, so all the winners have now been processed uh, for the giveaway. Uh, so I'm launching another giveaway. Uh, I can finally fly the Hecate, if I say it right. And we are fitted with the Scope Syndication skin, uh, showing it off in Potchevin. Uh, the colours really complement the skin really well. Um, wouldn't think it would, but look at the reflection. Just looks amazing. So I'm going to give away two of these um, in the next giveaway. So uh, please drop your comments in the description, uh, in the video down below, uh, and enter with your in game name, and we'll draw two of these uh, next Friday. Uh, so good luck, uh, and hope you enter. Much. Okay, so uh, straight to it. Um, so this is the Hakate. Um, basically, really basic fit. I'll drop all these out. Uh, and basically, it is a combat scanner probe ship uh, with blasters, uh, twin dual web. Uh, I haven't blinged this up very much, but I'm just going to get confident with it first, and then we'll go with some bling. Um, it's basically just a bit of a 130mm throwaway. Uh, and two mag stabs, damage control, small ancel, ram, and MWD. This actually goes really quick. Uh, this will go um, 2.3k. Uh, heated, it will go 3.3k. It's absolutely lightning in propulsion. Um, so basically, uh, I can't show you the Dicta fit because it died and I've not built another one. Um, but the idea here is basically um, we use the Dicta uh, to put bubbles, uh, tacticals on the gates and then the ships you should get caught in the bubble and then uh, we basically alpha them down with the carte and the dicta now i'm trialing it with different ships um so so far these are the kills we've got and this was a great fight so we'll talk through it uh, and we'll go thanks and pros and cons all right so this is the dicta uh, the heretic is the one that I was using uh, so this is obviously on my eagle firefly character now just to show you the bubble there uh, the two lines so how we set this up uh, basically we start to the gate that we're going to be doing the uh, disruption on and then we'll align out to the gate that's away from that gate uh, that's directly in line uh, with those bubbles and basically it will act as a drag bubble uh, so basically, if you pop the bubble while the pilot is in warp, it will land in the middle. If you have already dropped the bubble and you initiate the warp, the, and they initiate the warp, they'll land outside. So basically, i got a few little bits going on. Uh, this stiletto was toying with me a little bit. Um, so I had a little bit of a toy with uh, a stiletto uh, and an Enyo. Uh, so this uh, basically is the first time that I have tried out uh, bubbling or using dictas or anything like that so I'm a bit rusty with dropping the probe so I've got a little a lot of practice to do uh, but as you can see here the Enyo uh, was toying with me uh, I managed to get a little bit of armor in and then basically what happened there is the Enyo came to the edge of the bubble and burnt back in uh, but I didn't get the webs on in time um, because I'm still getting used to the multi-box in PvP side. I can only just about PvP with a single character. So dual box in PvP is like super hard for me right now. It's just I'm trying to find out the best way to, to move about my screens. Uh, so here we go again. Uh, so as you can see here, 
Uh, I'm learning as I go along about bubbling things as we move and things like that. Uh, so yeah, that's how we do that. Now I was obviously conscious spanning D scan because there was a couple of large fleets, and the last thing I really wanted to do was a bunch of um, big fleet just drop on me uh, because that was going to be over super super quickly. So then uh, we were playing about with this stiletto and Enyo, and then we we finally got uh, into a, a really decent engagement. So uh, they jumped in. And we had a little bit of a uh, an um and ah on whether it was going to happen or not. And they then, you know, I approached the stiletto, tried to get a lock on it, and I did. So, you know, probably a same situation, maybe a dual boxer, I'm not sure at this point. Uh, so this is how the fight progressed. It went really well. Um, hope you enjoy it. I'll throw some tunes on, and then we'll we'll get to it. <laughs> 